the Muji Kingdom! Zulu is alive! You cannot defeat me! Ah! Yes! People of our land! You cannot defeat me! Zulu is alive! I am alive! Greetings, Lion of Umuji Kingdom. Long may you reign. Did you find him, Mopili? We did not find him, my king. Not even a trace. I have driven him far away beyond the Green River where he belongs. Eyes of the gods and daughter of the night. You have done well as always. And may the gods reward you. Igwe Azuka, may you live long. I cast a spell that sent him far away. Zulu is now partly beast and partly human. The gods have punished him for the atrocity he committed, for killing an innocent woman. He has grown horns and shall forever remain in the black forest with animals. Amorphia. Let this be a warning to you all to desist from committing evil and taboo. Anyone found culpable shall be sent to the forest beyond the Green River where wild animals may eat up your flesh. Be warned! Princess, here the warrior. What does he want? Your heart, of course. My heart has been stolen. By who? Excuse us. <laughs> the rising sun of Umoji Kingdom. Your beauty enchants even the madman and has turned them back to sanity. What do you want from me? Your heart. Your heart, that's all I ask for. No one else is worth my love and affection in this kingdom. I am Ophili, the brave and the strongest warrior in this kingdom. And of course, you are the most beautiful. No one else is worth my love. I do not want your love. I do not want your affection. Excuse me. Was the last time you saw Shuka, the prince? Papa, he doesn't look my way. That is why you're a woman. Go after him. Papa. Lester. Shuka is one of the young men in this village that is yet to be betrothed. Hmm? So go after him. Make him to like you. Sit you see. Seduce him. Shuka is a man. And it's only women that have power to control men. A beautiful one like you.
hold your head high. See? Princess, I told you. Thank you. <laughs> That's nice of you. <laughs> what is it, my princess? What troubles you? So many years ago, Zulu was bound and taken to the forest beyond the Green River. I do not know him that well and only remember he was a child. A few years ago, he came back from the forest and rumor has it that he has changed. Why are you talking about that beast? Don't talk about him. He killed an innocent woman just because she refused him from touching her. But the gods judge him. He is not just an Usu, but the beast with horns. So why are you talking about Tommy? Why are you even talking about him? Nothing, mother. Just curious. Here comes our friend, Wilbibi. <laughs> Greetings, my queen. Golibe, how are you? I'm very well, thank you. I, I will excuse you. So you have time to enjoy. <laughs> okay, mother. <laughs> okay. Oh, Linda, sit down. So you are here. Yeah. <laughs> how are you? I'm very well. I brought this for you. Oh, wow. Thank you. Thank You're you. so kind, my queen. <laughs> Okay, it's, it's not for you. I brought it for the princess. <laughs> I know. It's not. Can I <laughs> it's okay, it's okay. <laughs> so how are you? I'm good. Wow. Are you? I'm okay. You can see. Um, I'll have to take my leave now. I will see you after the sunset. Why? It's all well. Yes. Everything is fine. Why did she flee? Did I scare her? I don't think so. Then why did she flee? I think she may be in love with you. <laughs> in love with me? <laughs> why are you laughing? Because I do not think so. Hmm. Time will tell. My king. <laughs> yes. We <I> understand. <laughs> I can see that you are as ready as the morning sun. Oh yes, Father. I will go now. Um, go well, my son. But bring pushments. Of course I will do that, Mother. Uh, Prince Chuka, please, wait. You will not go alone. Oh, Father. Father, I can take care of myself. No. You. Go with him. Your, your father. I said go home. Where wish my prince? Great prince of mine. Stop. You always avoid me. Why? Do I scare you? 
You do not scare me. I have a mission to accomplish. You will respect me. I am the prince of this land. I know who you are. A proud man that wants everyone to crawl and beg him on their knees. Proud? Yes. Proud. But I am not scared of you. I am Gulibi. The daughter of the strongest hunter that ever lived in this kingdom. I am an orphan. But we dare to go where men cannot reach. I will spread my wings and fly higher than any bird in the sky. I am not a slave. I am a tigress. A fighter. I will take my chances. <laughs> Follow her! What is fun? <laughs> No, I said, Look, Olibe, it's a no. Do I follow her? Huh? <laughs> oh, God. What do you want from me? Nothing. Nothing. Why are you here then? I'm here to hunt. That's exactly what I'm doing. What were you trying to do? Uh, you were was... doing nothing. You were touching and trying to take advantage of me. Touching you? Trying to take advantage of you? Is that all you can say to someone who actually helped you? You are ungrateful. Thank you. I may never see you. I may never meet you. You are far away. Why do I love you this way? Or just a talisman abstruse?
Why does my heart feel like it belongs to you? Do you feel the same way wherever you are? I wonder who you are talking about. No. <laughs> you cannot deny it. Don't even think about denying it. <laughs> it is written all over you. You are in love. I wonder who the lucky man is. Is it Ophili? Oh, I dislike that man. He's not the one. So who is the one? Someone far away. It is a wish. A wish? <laughs> Wishes do come true. <laughs> I know you're in love with my friend Golibe. Mm. It's a fact that I cannot deny. Of course I love her. I'm deeply in love with her, but she despises me. I guess it's a cross I have to carry. Excuse me. to reintroduce my daughter Oluchi to your son the prince they may have met before casually <laughs> it's your culture your daughter is a parcel of beauty <laughs> a maiden untouched <laughs> greetings my king on your feet greetings my prince on your feet um, what do you think of her, son? Mm. She's pretty. Very pretty. support my love for her. I know my father. He holds me in very high esteem. On her own part, I don't think she loves me. I don't think she feels the same way I do. My prince, hmm? you see, a woman's heart is deeper than the river. She may be hiding her true feelings from you, ask me. So, what do you think I should do? Well, uh, don't tell your parents yet, till you're very sure of her feelings for you. But if you ask me, she loves you too. Hmm. You think so? I know so. Time will tell. Okay. Time will tell. Mm. 
Why is the strongest man in Umoji Kingdom dismayed? She does not love me. She rejects me. I don't accept rejection. I, Ophili, can get any woman I want in this kingdom. And Uriah will not be an exception. You have to look before you and see what you're too blind to see. See what I'm too blind to see? You Nina, know, what exactly are you talking about? Oh, you're willing to give yourself to me? Yes. My heart sings a song and yearns for who will listen and sing along. His heart belongs to another. Hmm? I heard them. I heard them talking about her. Who is that? The infamous one. Who is the infamous one? Golibe. No, that cannot be. But it is, Papa. No, it will not happen. I will not allow it to happen. What are you planning to do? Oluchi, you don't know who your father is yet. Iguazuka is the king, yes, agreed. But I rule this kingdom. Did you hear that? I rule this kingdom. Shuka is yours. Even if I show you how I feel, what difference will it make? We are close, yet miles away. You are of reality, and I only an orphan. Love is a weakness, and my worth is my strength. I will never show you how I feel. You will never know how I feel. I know who your heart goes for. For Shuka. How dare you insinuate that evening? It is the truth. I've seen how you talk about him. Tell me, why is it too hard for you to show him how you feel? My heart does not beat for him. And I will not go for him. I despise him. Really? Yes, I do. But your eyes betray you. Here comes the princess. Oh. Pretty is able. I want to talk to Golibe. Okay, please. How are you, my friend? I I am well. <laughs> your eyes are full. As if your heart hopes. I am well. So how are you? <laughs> Um, Ebo, please get her a seat. Please. Oh, you can sit here. Mm. I 
So tell me, how are you? I cannot say the same. What bothers you? The unseen. The unknown. Is eating me up. Slowly. Slowly. And slowly. Oh yeah. What are you talking about? The forbidden. My heart goes for Zulu. He keeps haunting me. Both in my dreams and in my head. Alu. Uria. I'm losing my sanity. I'm obsessed with him. And I cannot tell anyone. The gods will not permit such. So please do not say it again. Don't. But you are my friend, and I have to tell you. Listen to me, Uriah. Zulu is no longer human. He has been punished by the gods, and now he is a beast. A beast with horns. How can you be obsessed with a man who is half human and half beast? A man who was banished from this land for killing a woman with a child in her womb. Uriah, he has been cursed by the gods. He is the accursed one and can never, never be normal again. Listen, do not think about it again. Hey! Igwe! They are here. What are you talking about to Choka for? Igwe stranger. Strangers in our land. Destroying my farm land and attacking our women. Strangers in our land. Destroying our women. Hey! Igwe! Igwe go and get it. Now you're mine. Igwe! I'm going to get it. I'm going to get it. That's impossible. No, this is unbelievable. Igwe, what do we do, Igwe? God! Go, oh, fetch your feeling, and it's so careful. We lead you to that. Yes, your highness. Immediately! Igwe! Hey! How am I? We will put them where they belong. I wasn't expecting. I came as a surprise. Take it. For me? Yes, for you. I'm actually very hungry. And you came at the right time. It's actually my pleasure. There's something on your head. Really? Let me move it. At me like that. Why am I looking at you like that? Anyway, she is a good girl and I like her for you. She's just my friend. She is just your friend indeed. Very understandable. I'm on my way to the farm. When you're done eating, make sure you join me at the farm. We are orphans. We have to fend for ourselves. And don't keep me waiting. You are a 
my brave and strong warrior. I am proud of you. Thank you, my king. Long may you reign. Go well, my daughter. You admire my daughter. <laughs> my king. Can I ask you a question? Of course. Have you ever been in love? No, my friend. Do not lie to me. Yes, my friend. Come with me. I need to take a stroll. unusual of you. What is quite unusual? Walking around as if searching for something. Have you heard of it? Yes. It's a whole of death. Lives have been lost. And rumor has it that a mighty snake hovers around there. Don't think about it, my princess. The rising sun of the morning. I do not like you. My princess, you have not said anything concerning what I asked you. What are you talking about? Since you do not like Ophili, who is the person that stole your heart? Someone fell away. The unseen. That is who my heart goes out for. And who could that be? Unseen and far away. I think she's in love with a stranger. 
I will find that stranger and kill him with my bare hands. No. You don't have to do that. Look at me. Just look at me. I am here for you. I'll be the sun that lights your day and the moon that guides you through the night. Make me yours. When I went outside to Wazongozi, the wife of uh, Mazi Okoye, she was weeping. I said that she had come to complain about the destruction of her farm produce. It was really terrible. Did you know, I agree with you. There are strange occurrences perpetrating from the neighboring village. Wait, wait, oh, wait. Oh. Let, let, let me ask. Who do they want from us and where are they coming from? They are from I, I told you. From Umuabu. Yeah. They want our land. Yes. Igwe, they want our land. They are jealous of our progress as a kingdom. Mm -hmm. And therefore, they will do anything within their power to take what does not belong to them. It will not happen. Eh? Igwe, I suggest we attack them and divide them. Simple. Come to think of it. Their land is even not as big as our own. Mm -hmm. We will place them where they belong. We will place them where they belong! I shall send them a warning message. And they will have no choice then to stick to peace. Peace! This shall never happen again in this kingdom. Not in my kingdom! The lion of my kingdom have spoken! Okay, man. Uh, Ichi Your you say you have something important you want to tell me. Yes, Your Majesty. Your Majesty, it's about your son, Sugar. You know, I have the best of interest for him. I saw him with Gulibe, the orphan. She was trying to seduce him. What? That cannot be. That low life. As if that is not enough. Rumor has it that she has been planning and scheming to get pregnant for him. So that she can end up being his wife. That cannot be. Not in this kingdom. The only one I prefer for my son is your daughter, Oluchi. <laughs> Not that Lola. That nonentity. I will not let it happen. Thank you, Igwe. Igwe, thank you very much. I have always loved to be in your presence. Are you special Yes, I wish. Yes. Thank you. After sunset. After Mother. <laughs> Urem. Mother. 
What is the problem? You've been keeping away from me for a while. What is taking your attention? Nothing, mother. Nothing. Really? Do not lie. I am your mother. I think I know you better. Anyway, that's not the problem. What's the problem, mother? Choka. Choka, your brother. Your father is not happy. Why? Your father thinks your brother has something to do with your friend, Kolibe. And I'm here to find out the truth from you. <coughs> um, mother, that is not true. They don't talk. Oh, you don't talk? Yes, mother. Better be true because your brother cannot sit in some Yes. Yes. But love is not less. Neither does it note culture or tradition. Years ago, you were just a little kid. Me, are you off to now? I want to see a friend. I hope it's not any of these uh, village boys. No, it's you, but <laughs> In the case you feel lonely, I call me. Hmm? And I can be your father, your friend, and you know the rest. <laughs> Thank you, Chief. I don't need your help. Stay here in my arms. No. I cannot. I do not want to. Why? Tell me why. I do not feel the same way for you. But your body says something else. Let me be. with me and listen to my heart yearning for you. If after that you do not feel the same way, I promise I will not disturb you again. You are back. Yes, greetings, well. You were with her. Yes, I was. It cannot be. That girl is not of your class and standard. She is not the most royalty. She is an orphan. A peon! You will have to stop loving her. I refuse it. Father, you cannot refuse her. You should know this, you are my friend. You cannot fight love. The more you try, the more you grows. You are, you dare me. Then you must be ready to dance to the music. 
I know what to do. I will do everything possible to make sure you do not put the name of this kingdom, my kingdom, to shame. Who are you? I will follow my hands. Oh, Chuka. You can see yourself. And you'll see your son. <laughs> I know what to do. Golibe. You know you are my friend. I want you to tell me the truth. Are you in love with my brother? I can see it in your eyes. You are scared of expressing it. My father confronted him when he heard the rumor that my brother is seeing you. The king is aware? Yes. You know how rumor flies. He was solely vest. Love knows no boundary, color, or people. Love must have its will. It doesn't always have its will. Some love are not meant to be. <laughs> if it's meant to be, it will be. Regardless of class, I am just an orphan. You are a strong woman. A strong woman who is not afraid to go where the river flows, where the road divides. A woman of beauty, strength, and power. That is who you are. Do not ever believe less. Thank you, Uria. Thank you so much. You are the only friend I have. You are also the only friend I have. Thank you. Something has been bothering me. What is it? <laughs> I have been having dreams of an old man beckoning me to go beyond the Green River in search for my heart. It says my heart belongs there. Uriah, you will not go. That place is dangerous and monstrous. And Zulu is evil. I shall go if the call becomes intense. I'm not at peace with myself. It's as though part of me is lost somewhere. What is mine? why you are crying let her enjoy him while it lasts it's just for a while how do you mean papa listen i told you i am in control of this kingdom the igwe is just sitting there as a king not even idia the great priestess understands my mystery time will unravel it and shuka will be yours it's okay I 
think you know why you are here. I do not know, my king. I hope all is well. You are overstepping your boundaries. I think you have failed to realize your place in this kingdom. Royalty is not and shall never be your place. I allowed you to be friend with my daughter, Rhea. For the same, you have chosen to take advantage of my benevolence. Stay away from Prince Juka. But my king, I... I know your type. You are attached to high places to alleviate your sorrows and misery. I will not allow you to bewitch my son. I do not know sorrow or misery. <laughs> I may not have any, but the little I have, I am contented with. I have warned you, and I will not repeat myself again. You may go. What do you want to say? Say now, I'm hearing you. The Prince and Golibe and their perceived love. Rumor has it that their love is very strong. It cannot be. Why? Because the king cannot settle for less. Golibe is just a commoner. And often it doesn't matter. I know. Huh? I know very well. But is it a crime for one to be in love? I just pray the, the king accepts it. Not in the history of Imoji Kingdom. If it were so, I would have flaunted myself for the prince to behold. Who makes you think that the prince will even look at you? <laughs> I am beautiful and fair to be looked at. But I have to accept my face because I do not belong to that class. sad and dismayed. What is wrong? The king has warned my sister to stay away from the prince. I understand. I understand, okay? But do not lose hope. There is no hope when the king has decided. There is hope. There is always a way. Look at the sky. Can you see those lines? Yes, I see them. What about them? Those are rays. Rays of hope. They are there to help us find out that there are many ways and many paths. Okay? So just calm down. What will be, will be. Okay? Lama, your words are always very certain to hear. 
Thank you. I like you. And I always want to be around you. <laughs> Murana, 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 Obrigado, Obrigado. Shall not be. Ichio Kocha, there are mysteries, but there are also mysteries. I do not understand, great idiot. Your daughter and Prince Chuka are parallel lines. They are like firewood infested with ants. There will always be love and hate between them. Prince Chuka will never love your daughter. It is not meant to be. Great idea. History. Rules and fates can be changed to suit our needs. I don't accept that. The gods have spoken. Then remove the obstacle. Remove the obstacle between Shuka and my daughter. Golibe is the obstacle between my daughter and Shuka. Kill her! Or we make her blind. It's your culture be warned before the god strikes you down. I am not afraid. I am invisible. <laughs> I am invisible. <laughs> Munana, I am Munana, invisible. Munana. I am invisible. Obriba, obriba. Where is Golibe, your sister? My prince, I do not think it is a wise decision to keep possession for her. Huh. Why do you say so? Your father, the king, warned her to stay away from me and threatened to take measures if she does not adhere to his orders. Where is she? I don't, I don't know where she is. Hey, bro. It is obvious you are lying to me. Hey, bro. I am the prince of Omoji Kingdom. I promise you nothing will happen to your sister as long as I'm alive. Where is she? to this tree so it's me when I got soaked in the mud I remember that night when I broke the news of father's death mother you left too early I 
I had to become a woman. A strong one. Hiding my fears. My weaknesses. And showing my strength. I think about you when the sun rises. Think of you when the sun sets. Think of you when the moon floats beyond the sky and goes into hiding. But I will never show you. I will hide it in my heart forever. You will never know my heart calls for you. And how I... long do you think you can? What are you doing here? Standing behind you. Listening to all your confessions. Yes. I do not know what you're talking about. Oh, please. You do know what I'm talking about. You cannot fight it. Confess it. It does not make you weak. It makes you... beautiful. It just cannot be. Of course it can be. It can be. I know about my father's plan to separate us. But it will not work. It will never work. Because you and I are strong together. I need you. And right now, I know you need me too. No. My love, you cannot fight it anymore. Don't. I... I love you. Chuka, Chuka, please, I beg you, don't do this to me, don't do this to me. Chuka, 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 please. I love you, I love you, please don't do this to me. Chuka, Chuka, please don't do this to me, please. Chuka, Chuka, please, just, 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 I love you, I swear I do. Chuka! <laughs> Sorry, I was alone at the stream when he came. Please forgive me, Your Highness. I, I am to be blamed. 
But I did not harm the prince. I cannot harm the prince or anyone else. My king, I am innocent. You cannot be talking about innocence here. Mm -hmm. You planned it. Who was your accomplice? Oh. You refrain. I warned you to stay away from my son. And you dared me. What impunity. Your Majesty, she deserves to be punished. She will be banished from this kingdom. Eyes of the gods and daughter of the night. What does the god say? My son is lying, still unconscious. It is unfortunate she is a magnet of bad luck and misfortune. How are we sure that she's innocent as she claims? She cannot be innocent. Ah. She is innocent. Then who wants my son dead? Time will unveil the mystery. It was her presence that brought the misfortune upon him. Will he survive? I have no words, Igwe, until the god speaks. You miserable incarnate. If my son had not grazed your evil presence, he will not be unconscious at this minute. You are therefore restricted from coming to this palace and anywhere in this kingdom. From this moment on, you are confined to your hut and his arena. If you are found anywhere else outside your hut and his arena, you shall be beheaded. Fine now, the lion of whom Oji has spoken. <laughs> the... Its rays has gone dim, and its light like a broken shadow. I cannot feel its warmth. The sun is shining, but you do not see the rays. But tell me, how do I go on? How do I go on knowing fully well that if anything happens to him, I will be held responsible? Look, I am confided within this place. Ibu, I have lost my freedom. Dear sister, nothing will happen to him. The king may confide you in this place. But he cannot contain your spirit. You are the brave one. Remember that. He held on to me. He held on to me and he did not want to leave me when he was hit by the arrow from the unseen. And for once, I saw it in his eyes. What did you say? Pains. Longing. Yearning and, and a vulnerable man behind that, that strong and undaunted man. And for once, you realize this love for you is true. That will not go on. I know I will never see him again once he becomes well. But I shall stand. I shall fight and hold his love very dear to my heart. That is my curse. The cross I will bear. <laughs> Gods of our land, help me, help us hasten the recovery of our son Chuka. I want him hale and hearty again. My king, do not be dismayed. Our son Choka will be well again. How long? How long? My king, when the clouds 
becomes full. Rain comes. Then after the rain comes the sun. The sun will shine again. The sun must not set at noon. The sun does not set at noon, but at dark. Our son Choka is still in the morning of his life. Everything will be well again. Would you... Your words are suiting to the ears. Not all times, my king. You want to ask for a favor? Urema, our daughter, is crying. She misses her friend, Golibe. Do not make mention of that name again here. I forbid you. Nena is equally her friend. You can send forth for her. She is one of the trusted maidens to this palace. Your Highness! Your Highness! Oh. Your Highness! The prince is awake. Prince? My son? Yeah, he's awake. My son is awake? Hey, my son. Please get up. Eh? We're here for you. Inugo, Biko, Benita Bezia. Chuka, my son. Talk to us. We are here for you, please. Golibe, Golibe, I need you. She is not here. Is I your father and your mother? Speak to us. Golibe. Hmm? Just get out home. Me chamo kandi do te Golibe. Biko. Me do te Golibe. Just get out. Oh, please, my son, get out. Ah, na masimo. Papa! 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 Papa, come, 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 come. Papa, come! Oluchi! Papa! Why are you so excited? Papa, you don't know how happy I am. To know that Kolibe has been restricted from going to the palace and anywhere around this kingdom. Really? I've got to think of it. Papa, she is now an object of ridicule on every villager's tongue. Eh? Yes! <laughs> I told you from the beginning, you know me, I am your father. <laughs> I told you from the beginning, but you did not believe me. Now you are seeing results. This is just the beginning of our mysteries. Mr. Oluji, sit down. Now, listen. There is something we are going to do. What is it? God. When the prince is hale and hearty, eh, you will seduce him. Let him make you a woman. That's when you get your place in the palace. But Papa. Do as I say. That's the only way you will get your place in the palace. You know, it is forbidden for the prince to have a child outside wedlock. Hmm? When you become pregnant for him, he will be forced to marry you. You become his wife and the lord of our kingdom. The ro a royal child cannot be born outside the palace. You understand that? Papa. <laughs> Papa. <laughs> I told you from the beginning. Papa is yours. Papa. <laughs> hey. Papa. Papa. Yeah. I trust you. Yeah. I trust you. <laughs> I'm so happy. You are the chosen one. Was it for what? Because of the element, the realm of Charlie. I do not know what you are talking about. Go into the night, follow the moon, and search for that. That which calls you. That which haunts you and throughout your days and nights. Is the key to the truth. Find what? And what truth are you talking about? You must go to the cause of the element to be broken. Go beyond the green river 
and on earth the rest of our life. I shall go nowhere. Then your heart will not find it to so your people shall live under the truth. Your heart is beyond the very river. Go, that you may find peace and love. Go now. Go. Go. The gods are with you. is between you and I. What is it? I'm about to take a journey. I shall go beyond the Green River. Uria, have you gone insane? No, my friend. I must go now. I had the same dream again. But this time around, it was impulsive and stronger. The old woman said that I must go to unravel a truth and to break the course of the elements. And I'll forever remain lonely if I disobey. Listen, Oria, you have to inform the priestess. I mean, this might be a trap. It is not a trap. I must go now. But I want you to go with me. Please, Golibe. You are my most trusted friend. Please, I need you now more than ever. Oria, this is not wise. Trust me, it is not. We may not come back alive. The route you want to take is the haven of death. It has swallowed so many souls. The girls are with me. I must go now. Come, my friend. Are we go now. Goodbye, my friend. Now you let her go. Oh, 
go back to your people. Tell them that I have found my wife. I have found my heart. Let her go. <laughs> Let her go. She's mad. <laughs> Back to my people. You're a killer and a rapist. for you, princess. No, she hasn't been to my place. Are you sure? Yes, Your Majesty. Hey, look at that! Okay, why are you two following me about? Okay, hey! She was determined to go. I, I saw a strange boldness in her eyes. I couldn't leave her alone. If the king finds out, I will be killed. It was my fault. It was not your fault. It was. I shouldn't have followed her. I should have tried to stop her. Now, I don't know if she is alive or dead. Gods of our land. Gods of our land, please. Please guide and protect her. Guide and bring her back. Please. What will you do now? I'll go to the palace and tell them the truth. What truth? No, you shall not go. I cannot bear to lose you. Abel, the eyes of the gods will reveal it after all. I have to go to the palace to prove my innocence. No! L let us run away. Maybe far away from this kingdom where, where no one can find us. There is nowhere to run to. <laughs> I will go. If I die, <laughs> so be it. Great idea. Please, I want you to blame her. Uh, lay all the blames on her. You know, both of them were, were best of friends. So you will be believed. Tell the Igwe that Golibe was responsible for the disappearance of Ode. Eh? Tell the Igwe that she wants to bring the palace to win. Great idea. It, was, it, is, it is just a humble request of mine. Eh? Can't you see that uh, uh, Golibe is a stumbling block between Shuka and, and, and my daughter? I want her out of the way. Hmm. Golibe is innocent. Uh, uh, uh. Great idea. Please. Just do this for me. Do this for me, Ada. 
promise. I assure you that whatever you ask for, I will bring it. Just name it. Eh? Goats, yams, cattle. Just name it. Even farmlands. Uh, if you even want my manhood for sacrifice, I will bring it. Ichi Okocha, leave my presence at once. You are here but banned from my temple. If I see you anywhere close to my temple, I will tell the people of Umoji your evil plans. Now leave! <laughs> yeah, great idea. It, it was just a joke. Eh? But you can think about it as a, as a serious joke. Leave! Please, think about it as a serious joke. She asked me to go with her to the Green River where her heart lies. I, I had to follow her because, because I didn't want her to go alone. She is my friend. So, so I was scared of what might become of her. So I had to follow her. Then, when we got there, she changed her mind. But, but, but then it was too late. And then a, a man with horns came out and captured her. I, I, I tried to fight. I, I tried. And then, then they were gone. You planned it. You laid an ambush for her. Yes. Why did you to report to the palace after you met her? Why? Because you're a liar. Your Highness. Your Highness. She may be saying the truth. Uh, Lies! <laughs> you lie! You are the cost one. You sent my daughter to the land of death. Your head will rule for this. God! Please, my No! Please. No! Igwe, elders of our land, give me a place of her. My sister is innocent. Your sister is evil. The gods of our land, speak to me. Speak to me in silence. Speak to me. into my chambers with that thing. Great one. The eyes that see the unseen. I need your help. Golibe, I believe she's innocent. Yes. They may kill her if you do not intervene. Pico, help. I knew you would come. Where there is love, there will always be a way. Hi. She's not... The princess had made up her mind and she could not be stopped. Kill me and let her go. No, no. My sister is innocent. No, it's okay. Igwe, please. It's okay, my brother. It's okay. Let them kill me. No, 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 no. no. But I pray the gods bring Uriah back to this kingdom. No one beheads an innocent one. She is innocent. She is not innocent. She is not! She is innocent! No one dares to behead an innocent one, else her blood will be on your hands. Igwe, Lion of Umoji King. She must be made free to move about like every other maiden. Your son is hale and hearty. Uden is guilty. Yuria was possessed by the wind of the night, and so she followed her heart. Golibe escorted her just as a friend would do. Her heart belongs to the place of life, not the place of death. 
What does that beast Zulu want from my daughter? He should be dead, not alive! Revenge! Igwe, revenge. The gods will kill him when they deem fit. He was banished by the gods. He was banished and punished by the gods for his sin. So he dare not touch my daughter. I need your help in this. Uriah must not be defiled. Igwe, my hands are tied. Send your warriors. You and I know that the Grim River does not spare the common man. Help her before it's too late. Igwe, send your warriors. They need fortification. The gods have spoken. Gods are not asleep. They will protect Aichi Okocha. They will. The gods are asleep. As far as I am concerned, in my territory, the gods are asleep. Do not dare! I dare you an even more, and you shall be a failure. Hey! Aum Agbalawani, the tigress of Umoji Kingdom. Ikukwa <laughs> Mononya. The Black Isle and the Daughter of the Night. I dare you! If you try it, you will burn! Don't dare me! Don't! Where is Sophili? Your Highness, he refused to come with us. Go oh, get him! Leave him! Let him be! He has made a decision. Let those willing go. Munene, 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 oh. Obribo, obribo. Munene, 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 oh. Obribo, obribo. you through the green river and into the seven lanes of mysteries that will be your greatest hurdle let the gods lead you go go, go! but you have to be very careful the people of this kingdom despise you i know i know they do not like me but just as the sun rises in the morning, I shall not be defeated. But there is one who loves you and will do anything. Chuka. But we are not meant to be. Do not give up on love. 
maybe his love for you will liberate this kingdom. I heard he was the one who went to the great priestess Edia to plead on my behalf to come and save me. I love him and wish we were together. But that is all I can do. Only wish. I wish for love. I wish for Uriah to come back alive. But that is as far as it goes. Wishes. Wishes. They do come true. Trust me. I go search for her. No, no. We have to consult the priestess first to know what to do. So, oh, God, my son, you have been rather dismayed for too long. Is there any other thing that troubles the prince? Yes, Father. What can it be? You, Father. Me? You are joking, aren't you? I am not joking, Father. You do not want the best for me. If you do want the best for your son, then you will respect my decision. Oh, now I know where you are coming from. Listen, my son. There are some sacrifices you need to make. And this is one of them. You cannot be with that girl. Why? Father, tell me why. There is nothing wrong with Kulibe. She is an orphan. She's just like any other girl who deserves to be loved. She can't be loved by any other commoner like her. Not you. As long as you love her, I will hate her. She is a nobody, not suited for you. Find another woman suited for you. Any other maiden. Father, no other woman can make me feel the way Golibe makes me feel. I'm sorry if I cannot be with her. Then I will not be with any other woman. Mind the words, It cannot be her. It cannot be. You allowed your warriors go alone, Ophili? Yes. Is her love not worth fighting for? I tried my possible best, but she ran off me. I cannot sacrifice my love, my life for her. So you do not care if she dies? I'm afraid I don't care anymore. I know why you did not go. It's because you don't love her. I love her. I always do. It is so unbearable. Never love you, never love you. We're nothing to me but a passing time. What? How dare you throw it at my face? Never you raise your hands to me again. You will never find love. No woman will love you as I did. I curse you this day. Thank <laughs> you. 